Hi there, my name is Jo Thompson and I'm one of the lecturers at the University of South Wales with the midwifery team. So I'm here today to tell you a little bit about the midwifery course at the University of South Wales. So you apply through UCAS. Typical qualifications needed would be three Bs at A level or equivalent. You would also need a minimum of five GCSEs, including English and Maths at grade C or above, or their equivalent. So sometimes um, these requirements might change, so it's best to have a look on our website for the most up-to-date information. So after applying through UCAS, if your, if your application is successful, you'll be invited for an interview. The interviews take place either online or face-to-face -face, um, with one of the midwifery team and sometimes with one of our clinicians as well from one of our local partner health boards. During the interview you'll be asked some general questions and you'll have an opportunity to ask us any questions you may have. The midwifery course at the University of South Wales is a three-year degree programme. You spend 50% of your time um, within the university learning theory and 50% of your time in clinical placement. So when you're in theory, you will learn through a variety of ways, including lectures, tutorials, independent learning and practical skills session in our clin clinical simulation suite. So year one of the course focuses predominantly on normality, okay? So you'll explore topics such as health promotion, professionalism, anatomy and physiology, and you'll learn some key midwifery skills. You'll also spend time on your placement, both in, um, in the hospital, in maternity settings, and within the community, working alongside qualified midwives. Year two of the course develops on that knowledge that you've gained in year one and explores some of the complications that can arise during pregnancy and labour and the postnatal period. You'll cover topics such as legal and ethical issues, research, quality improvement and systematic examination of the newborn. Year three explores topics such as compassionate leadership and change management, holistic care planning, additional care needs and deteriorating health. Successful completion of the three years of the course allows you to register with the Nursing and Midwifery Council as a qualified registered midwife. So clinical placements are provided in a, low, in a number of local health boards, as well as core maternity placements, you'll also get experience in areas such as neonatal units, gynaecology, main theatres and critical care. If you have any further questions or you want any further information, then please do visit our website, which is www.southwales.ac.uk forward slash courses forward slash BSC Hans Midwifery. We look forward to meeting you in the future.